Great. Seventh class. It's all going well. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's, that's what I'm gonna say for this. A staircase in the preparation room. Never noticed one. I wonder where it could be. If the scarecrow went down there with the doctor, it would need to be a pretty big opening. I'll have to go and look. 7 p.m. already. We only have three hours until we're overrun with bloodthirsty humans. We don't know for sure if there's an escape route in the basement, but it's our best bet. Maybe we should go get everybody from the gym to come with us as soon as we find the stairs. Leave that to me. Mr. Leone! I'll take care of the other students. Don't worry, I'm not a massive agent for nothing. Well then, thank you, Mr. One. Um, you aren't going with him, sir? I'm going to come with you, Guara. We never know what could happen. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. I am your homeroom teacher, after all. You've done such a good job so far. I want to be there to help you if things get dangerous. What about you, Sakuya? You two go ahead. I'll catch up with you. Right, okay. We're gonna get out of here together, okay? Too much has happened today for both Sakuya and me. I don't know what's on his mind, and he doesn't seem interested in telling me, but if he wants to be alone, that's for the best. I guess it's the two of us then, Mr. Nanaki. If something bad happens, one of us can come back to warn you, and the other is Mr. Leone. Understood. Commence Operation Breakout it is, then. Not so fast! Hi, Angle. What, Angle? What does he want now? We don't have time for messing around. Textorius Melodophonus, you now travel to the Abyss of Despair. Do you not? The uh, Abyss of Despair? I sense demon spores far greater in power than those released by the Tree of Blight. I cannot allow you to face the Dark Sorcerer Wallenstein alone. The Wallenstein guy is the doctor, right? Okay, uh, we're coming for you, Wallenstein. Wait, Angle, we need to be careful! Wait! He certainly is lively. Let's go. Kazuyaki never gave a shit. It's like, yeah, whatever, it's fine. Just spat off crazy bullshit in my presence. I'm like, okay, bye, see you later and tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, my brain's kind of scrambled, can you tell? <laughs> I think this is the first time I've been in here. It's kind of bland. Hmm, yes. Not a very friendly room, but not distasteful either. This place is flooded with demon spores. Any good bird would normally avoid it. Can you think of anything, sir? Like a hidden door, or... I don't come here very much, so... Hmm. Do you feel a draft? A draft? There are no windows in here. It must be coming from the basement. Okay. <gasps> be silent, my crimson breast. We must hold it back, or the ology of doom will... Gate of Erebus, guide me to the abyss! Wait, calm down. Angle, you can't! Just let him go, man. Just let him go. Oh, there it is. So it was behind the mirror all along. Of course. He he's a lot more clever than he acts, isn't he? Even if he does spout nonsense wherever he whenever he opens his beak. Let us proceed. The proceed for feed. Let us proceed. Textorus Melodia Funis, the master of the abyss, waits us below. Okay. Long dark star star staircase. 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 A long dark staircase winds downwards behind the mirror. How far does it go? The basement itself should be pretty big. This is sort of like the entrance into a subway tunnel. Let's go. Ooh, there it is. Very impressive. This is a lot fancier than what I expected. Never knew this huge place was underneath the school. This facility has been used for research to kill humans since before the school was... Well, since the school was founded, not since before. At least I wouldn't hope it was before. I, Scarlet, none of us ever knew. We lived our carefree lives with all of this going on beneath our feet. Hmm, I don't see any birdie. Wonder if it's closed now. Yeah, it's clean and orderly, but I don't get the feeling that it's still in use. There was a fire somewhere down here five years ago, and since then the whole facility has been shut up. I suppose they froze whatever project they were working on. Hey, Angle! Which way do you think we should go to find the doctor? That would be- Ah! My crimson breast murmurs! The Midnight Hunter approaches. Midnight Hunter? Hi. Huh? C couldn't you 
have said so earlier? Oh dear, if we don't get past him, we can't go on. We cannot reach Wallenstein without first defeating his dark servant. This trial cannot be avoided. I'm saving. That's that's code for I'm saving. But all we've ever managed to do is run away from this thing. How can we? This could go very badly. We can't get anywhere just by running away. Do we have any sort of weapon? Weapon? I do have the stun gun Mr. Leone let me. Will even work on a scarecrow? Maybe not at a normal output, but it looks like a living creature, so I doubt it would be completely unaffected. I don't think it's living. The Midnight Hunter is a hound bred from the Black Void. We must purify it with holy water. Oh yes, that's a good idea! What, what, what did he even say? There's a fire hose on the wall there. If we time it right... Mr. Nanaki wobbles towards the wall and pulls out the hose. Of course! Ready? He points the hose at the scarecrow and opens the valve. Angle, sir! Get back! I set the stun gun to maximum and hurl it at the scarecrow. Okay. That was smart. <laughs> Collapses with an unpleasant noise. Its electrified metal arm twitches for a moment, but then it is still. We did it! Electricity is a powerful thing indeed. The thunderous voice of doom. Judgment has come! Good for you, Angle. He, uh, uh, oh. Goodbye, Mr. Scarecrow. Onwards! I wonder if, the, like, this is actually the HD release of this game? Um, I wonder if, like, you actually had different, like, choices and, uh, you know, ways to go through this. I know that it's said that you can't, like, fail or die or whatever in the HD release due to some changes, but I, I don't know. That'd be cool. Disgraceful. What am I doing here? A label is not allowed hesitation. No, I have not even the right to claim that restriction anymore. You, yeah, foolish. No, not ish at all. I am a fool. I have been pampered my entire life while my shadow, while in my shadow he crawled along under the weight of a crime of which he only knew, which only he knew. Wow, sorry, my brain is just fucking blown with this game right now. I have been nothing but vain and selfish. Oh, Sequoia. What should I do, Yuya? Cuckoo! It is Sakuya! Sakuya is here! Hi, San. Leave. No one wanted you to come here. Goo! Everyone is leaving! It is a grand daring escape! Cuckoo! Sakuya will find Ryota with Okasan! Away we go! Shut up. Don't talk to me. Coo! Sakuya weeps. N no! I do not! It is raining! Cuckoo! Is Sakuya in pain? That is bad. We must do something about it! Coo coo coo! Okasan, use healing touch! Confound you! Must I repeat? Coo coo! Okasan knows Okasan heard that Yuya has gone somewhere far, far away. We will never see him again! So, they told you. Coo! Do not worry. If we cannot meet him, we need only chase after him. Do you have any idea of what you're saying? Death is not a good place to chase someone to. Without the older breeds, have no concept of death. Chase Yuya, Yuya into the grave? What kind of fool would. Coo! Okasan knows the earth is a ball, so we've run if we run far enough, we will find him. What foolishness. Speaking with mongrels makes my head hurt. Except I'm a mongrel too. Poor mongrels who do not notice even their own error, that is. Cuckoo! Okasan is not a mongrel! Coo! Sakuya and Yuya and Okasan all have their wonderful names. Names more important than any breed. Is that your argument? That isn't even You are yourself. Never let anyone tie you down. I am myself. Cuckoo! It is time to go! Okasan and friend are late! Coo! Kick Reese into the curb! Time to blast out of this prison and find Yuya! Oko is always brimming with useless energy as he was. Am I the same, perhaps? We will never see him again, no matter how far we run. But if he were here now, what would he do? 
What would he want me to do? At any rate, moving around here won't get us anywhere. Two more hours. I will chase after him. I will never find him, but I will find myself. Let us go, Oko. There is nothing more for us here. Cuckoo! Sakuya is best when he acts cool. After Yoda, full speed ahead. Okay, that's fine. The demon spores are thick in the air. I smell the stench of the sorcerer. I feel a little nervous relying on Angle's bizarre intuition alone, but it's worked so far and we're in a hurry. Is he actually following the doctor by his scent? Or was that just an Angleism? Who knows, just run with it. There's some very advanced equipment in here. And these documents look fairly new. Maybe this place is still in use. There's a register of names left open on one desk. Maybe it's a student register? Look, your name's here too, Angle. The dark grimoire. I feel the tendrils of imminent tragedy. They have notes on some of the students too, under Hikure. He acts as a neurotransmitter when excited. He seems to produce intoxicating or hallucin hallucinogenic pheromones. Physical exertion acts as a stimulant. The pheromone causes others to temporarily lose control of themselves, but its usefulness is limited, not currently applicable to combat. Uh. How many of us are fucking experiments? I shall not allow the sorcerer to make me his pawn. I am the Crimson Angle of Judica, destined to wander this earth alone. I'm not sure what he's talking about, but he sounds and looks unexpectedly heroic. Looks like all the students who were invited here have some sort of physical idiosyncrasy. How did you enroll, Kawara? How? I was invited too. I don't know why. Hmm, yours is just a bunch of numbers. I wonder if it's the explanation or something like Yuri's. <gasps> no, the black miasma of inevitable doom draws near. We are approaching the gate of the abyss. I feel its foul winds. Also, he really reminds me of, like, Sears from Harry Potter. Especially Trollney. I, I probably butchered the fuck out of her name. You know, Sybil, one of the teachers? Divination teacher? Crazy, but awesome and actually right most of the time? Anyway. Um. Let's go. The doctor's waiting for us. Could you wait a minute, Quara? What is it, sir? We're almost done. We need to. I want to ask you something first, Quara. You lied, did you? not you? Did you not, you mean? I'm 99% sure that this was translated from uh, Japanese. With Japanese, what you will notice is that the sentence structure in English is usually constructed in a different way than Japanese. Like this. Did not you? Usually it's like, did you not? It's basically, it just switches around. Um, you'll notice that with a lot of, uh, subbed animes. If they don't, if they just do a, like a, you know, do, uh, subtitles off of the, uh, original Japanese audio. If it's dubbed and it has subtitles too. I've noticed it with, uh, Inuyasha on Netflix. Um, it goes off of the original Japanese audio. For the subtitles, even though I have the dubbed uh, version of the audio turned on. Um, and it's kind of interesting to see the difference in, um, in what's being said in English and what's being said from the original Japanese. Anyway, just wanted to say that. That's where a lot of the um, different uh, like translation issues, as you can see here, come from. Anyway, now that that's said, moving on. Huh? Lied? Me? I don't know why you would lie about that. Or maybe you forgot, even though it was just yesterday. Yesterday, after school? Like I said to Sakuya, I don't know anything about it. We have to ask the doctor. Hmm, I see. Let's go on then. Okay! Rihanna, what did you forget? 